Now my question is a serious one. All right. Okay. Is Joe Biden up to the job of being president? And as a little reminder, take a look at your president and the monitor. And there's an awful lot of stories that are told, but probably a bunch apocryphal about uh, um, uh, the former prime minister. Uh, like you take baths up there. Anyway. Wandering around at three in the morning. <laughs> yeah, Winston Churchill. By the way, I met with the... Uh, who are those guys that fly over shortly? You heard of them, haven't you? And the cheer for Muslim, for, we cheer for Muslim athletes like Kareem Al- 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 Abdul Jabbar. I know him, and I did mispronounce his name. So uh, I'm trying to think. What was the last? Where was the last place I was? It's hard to keep track. Um, I was. I, I mean, yeah, you're right. Ireland. That's where it was. Eight e i g h percent. He said, you're too much, you're too much like that guy who led the revolution instead of the guy who was the prime minister. I said, who's, he said, you got to be less like the military guy. They shot him. Well, God bless you all. Let's go. Let's go lick, lick the world. Let's get it done. And then you got Joe Biden is having a hard time standing up. Take a look at that one. Standing up. Take a look at that one. I want you to tell me that you think he is cognitively strong enough to lead this country against China, Russia, Iran, North Korea, and a war- new axis of evil, and that he's the guy, he cannot articulate the economy the way you just did. Yeah, but uh, I don't think he's capable. I know he's capable. I see results. I've seen a master class in results the last few 